Hey guys, this is Elena from We Learn to Share. In this video, we're gonna learn how to know like whether your LSR model is good or bad by using something that is called the residual or the residual plots, right? So um, the residual that we have over here in this video is basically something that is called the error. Mm -hmm. And you can get the residual by subtracting the predicted value y hat from the observed value y. So you you guys need to remember that you're gonna get your com you're gonna compute your error or residual by subtracting the predicted value from the observed value. So observed minus predicted equals the residual. Again, observed minus predicted equals the residual. And there are some facts about residuals that you definitely need to know. That the sum of the residuals is always zero. And the mean of the residuals is also always zero. And the slope um, of a least squares regression of the residual on x is also zero. But you don't need to really remember that. It's really just important to remember that the sum and the mean of the residuals is always, always zero. And now we're going to learn something that is called the residual plot. A residual plot is a scatter plot that plots residuals on the y-axis um, and the corresponding x values on the x-axis. And you can say that our LSR model is a good model if the residual plot shows a uniform scatter of the points from minus 2 to 2. And you will say that our LSR is a bad model if um, you if the residual plot shows the following patterns, which should be um, whether if it is increasing or decreasing spread about the line as x increases or if it has a curve pattern. And now let's just draw quickly a residual plot for the sake of understanding it better. So you typically have a residual over here, right? Residual on the y-axis. And you will have your ex explanatory over here, right? And then there, the interval will be over to my plus 2 to minus 2. And then like uh, this is a scatter plot. So it, it's going to be, it's going to look like something like Sorry, that's too messy, like something like this, right? And you're going to say that, let's say that you have interpreted a line of best fit like something over like this or like this. You're going to say that this would be a good model because it looks, um, it gives you a kind of uniform pattern and it is, after all, between the intervals minus 2 and 2, right? But you're going to say that it is a bad LSR model if it gives you a, a residual plot like this. Like something like this. I mean, it looks bad, sorry. <laughs> like this or like this or like this. So if it actually gives you an increasing or decreasing spread or if it shows a curved pattern, you're going to say that this is a bad um, LSR model that you can interpret from drawing your residual plot and this would be how you're going to interpret your lsr model how good it is by using your residual plots and yeah this is the end of the video and thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel and like this video see you in the next video